Hi everybody, welcome to Ukrania Gaming. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm so happy uh, we start playing Rimworld with the new expansion Royalty, which includes a lot of new content and it was totally unexpected. Um, this game is uh, very well known uh, because uh, it was strongly inspired by, by Prison Architect, but then uh, Ludion Studios has done such a great job and they have uh, literally reinvented uh, the engine. And now we can build a colony in the deep space with uh, all the sort of uh, events and, and, and buildings and technologies. And now with the Remove Royalty also, Quest, Psychic Powers and the huge brand new Empire, which will give us a lot of work to do. So, without further ado, I'm going to start a colony now in Iron Man and I'm going to play so we will be able to discover all the news in this game. I will now click on the crash landed. If you guys want to see the, the, the seed I will also show to you uh, as soon as the map is created. I will use Cassandra, medium um, difficulty and uh, a commitment mode as I said, so I won't be able to reload. Bramble is the seed name if you want to play in the same map. And now I will show you one thing. We uh, play without any mod because I want to show you guys uh, what is the content of this free patch, the 1.1. Which, is, uh, which has been released on the 24th of February together with the DLC and the DLC um, royalty. As you can see in the map, you, can, you, can ha you have already uh, new things. First of all, you have uh, some unions which are different from the normal TP of the natives. That's, that's funny, interesting. Then we have a new brand new icon, which is this kind of half column. Uh, this is a new faction. The faction of the empire the exodus empire trading here requires a title knight or dam titles are gained through quests and uh, that's very interesting we will see that in the, during the game i want to play close to one of those uh, centers this map is actually quite of quite strange because it has like two big continents with a lot of desert in it i'm not going to make my life so hard and i will play in an area where i could trade or uh, reach uh, a city quite easily this is uh, actually a kind of good area and the temperate forest uh, which allows me to um, gather food for 30 days it's not bad either I wanted to have uh, maybe yeah I would like to see if I can found my city somewhere else that's also not bad at all which would we would be able to uh, basically um, harvest uh, food uh, 360 3,000 days <laughs> per year uh, that's not bad that's not bad I, I think I would take this one it's a tropical rainforest though so I might have issues with animals. I don't want to make it extremely difficult, but actually, this is this is very good. It's very good. A lot of trade, a lot of areas. Um, we have uh, berries. We have uh, a flat, a tropical rainforest. Let's start from here. And now I'm going to randomize my characters until I don't have a, a quite good uh, kind of team. So. I think I put together a good party. Now, guys and girls, say hi to Barry Curtis. He's our fighter artist. Uh, he's actually okay because he's incapable of nothing, so he, be, he will be also supporting us in the research and the, in, in the social activities. Um, then there is uh, uh, Ting Ting. She's our uh, doctor. She's also an, an, an important artist. She's very good in building and she has also some social skills. And then we have Zebo, which is okay with uh, shooting, construction, cooking, and the fields. I don't have a great miner. Mm, I don't have a great shooter, but for the rest, I think I'm kind of covered, and we will include way more um, colonists later on. So this is okay. That's not going to be a, a big problem. I just want to start this this game, and hopefully. We will survive for a while, hopefully. <laughs> I'm going to show you right away all the um, new buildings that we have at the beginning and uh, the new, sorry, the, the new furniture, I would say, and also the new technologies. Uh, there is a all new branch for weapons, for musical instruments, for example, uh, new ways to entertain ourselves and uh, uh, new clothing lines, because if you want to be a king, you need to have the right clothes. Wow. Our forest is very big and very 
forest. I'm going to ask my guys to take immediately as soon as they can uh, some uh, of the food that I see here. All the steel, for example. Is there other steel in the map? Usually, if you double click, you can see that. No. Yeah, here. Wonderful. Bud! He's our doggo. He's our doggo. Okay, good. So, let's get started. Social. What can you do, my friend? You are melee, so you take this knife. Zebo is not bad uh, uh, in shooting, so you can take this bolt rifle. Tintin is uh, very bad with everything, so... Maybe it's better if he takes the revolver and Tintin takes the knife, so uh, just for the moment, just for the time being. And uh, we need to find a place where we can actually, yeah, fertile land, where we can start uh, cultivating the soil. I like this area. It's a pity because I don't have a lot of uh, structures I could rebuild or reuse. Columns are a new, a, a, a new object. They're actually working like walls, but they are smaller, so they sustain the, the weight of uh, our ceiling. So they prevent any building to collapse. I think I could use this area as a basic barrack for, for the moment. And uh, let, let's build right away here, let's say a storage area. We don't have enough wood, I know, I'm aware of it. But we create two doors, one is going down under where we will have our living uh, area. And uh, here we will just cut the plants so we have some space. Talking about that, let, let's uh, uh, do one, only one thing, then we unpause the game. Stockpile area here, dumping area here, and then you guys can go. And now let's get started. Priorities. Firefight. Ting Ting cannot firefight, she's too afraid. Patient, one for everybody. Doctor is only Ting Ting. Bed rest for everybody. Basic for everybody. Warden, only for Ting Ting. Barry can be, let's say, a backup with a four, only if necessary. Handle animals. At the moment, no one can do that. We will need someone which can handle animals easily, because two is horrible. Cooking is Zebo, only Zebo. Hunting is uh, Uish. I think I think Zebo because he has the rifle, right? So he's our hunter. Building for everybody, but. Uh, Ting Ting gets the priority and Zebo number two. Drawing is Zebo. Barry will be a backup. Uh, Ting Ting with a two will not touch any crop. Mining, everybody with a three, but Ting Ting with a two. Plant cut, everybody with a four. Zebo maybe with a two. Smithing, so far we have no uh, real good crafters, so we have to wait. Art. Barrel has no priorities, he will have a one, Ting Ting a level three. Hauling and cleaning, so let's take the one with less uh, tasks, I would say. Barry could have a one in hauling, Ting Ting one in cleaning, and Zebo two in both. Research for Barrel instead. Kind of good. What do you think, guys? Okay, our friends are building the bark, where they will store all the food and all the um, equipment and the supplies they have from their previous trip. Um, I wanted to show you now the research uh, area. Look at this. We can start researching right away the harp, which will unlock uh, an instrument, a musical instrument, the harpsichord and the piano, or the noble apparel, or the royal apparel, like a crown and royal robes. This is fantastic. One thing I didn't talk about is um, the fact that now we have quests as well. Uh, so sometimes the, the nobility of the empire will ask to our colony to help somehow and will bestow some grace, let's say, making our colonists a little bit more than commoners uh, to the level which, where they can become knights or dams and start being treated uh, uh, au pair with the other members of the empire. This is, this is really fun. Now this first part is done, I think I should build uh, the second barrack, 
where we have uh, the bed beds um okay let's ask uh, to clean up everything here as well not only chop food that was my mistake uh cut plants everything and let's build uh, as furniture uh three beds we can make them out of wood uh, it's not a big deal Perfect, at least we will not sleep under the heavy rain or stuff like that. But I think that now those guys will go to bed and some of them are sleeping on the floor. It's alright for one day. It's alright for one day. Let's give now our uh, routine. The recreation starts at 7 for 2 hours. So from 7 a.m. till 7 p.m. they work. And then they have 2 hours for themselves. They, they have to go to bed. Between them... Between the alarm, the clock alarm, and uh, the work uh, shift, uh, and the end of the creation, and the night shift, I always leave one empty slot, so they can do whatever they want. They can eat, they can do recreation, I don't know. What? Okay, our dog has just been killed by, um, by a panther. I knew that it wasn't a good idea to start in the middle of a jungle, but... Um, it is as it is, we are trying to now hunt the panther. <sighs> now uh, this uh, will try to, let's say, revenge. Okay, good. It's a pity because I love to have the idea of having a terrier, but... Look, I can build a drape, a brazier, a throne or a grand throne, which is unbelievably fun, because we could have a throne in our sleeping room. <laughs> or, I could build even funnier, we can build steels, like, like uh, monuments to remember some event or something. Can I use a, a, like a grave for my doggo? I don't think so, no. Such a shame. It's a pity, but what can we do? Let's start uh, securing our floors here. We don't have enough food, okay? We have to cut this food, and we will. Uh, we are going to do it anyways because now, what I always do usually is to create a big enough field, field big enough to support our food needs in the next uh, couple of seasons so a very big um, rice field is what we need we will have to clean this area so also chop a lot of trees and then we will use those trees to prepare our bedroom as i see uh, taming animals will not be so easy if we are in the middle of the jungle with panthers and predators around let me check another topic. Power so far is the same. Production is so far the same. In the security panel, you can see that we have the barricades. So now sandbags require clothing to be built, which is interesting. And barricades are just uh, kind of walls where a shooter can uh, take cover. And that's kind of interesting. After doing this area, we do a smaller field. In this case, we plant hill roots. And another one, also small, where we plant uh, uh, cotton, because I will have to craft some clothes soon. So let's get started. And after that, okay, our bedroom is done, our barrack is done, our storage area is done, and uh, probably it would be also a good idea if my uh, guys can eat on a normal table. We take a three, three, three table, and we use maybe four chairs. This one I will delete it. So when they have breakfast or supper or dinner, whatever, they can sit. They don't eat standing, which is actually a very bad malus. After that, I can already use some concrete here, and I always do that. I Isolate, isolate my living area with two layers of concrete because in case of fire 
uh, the fire will not catch the wooden walls. I will I will turn them into uh, bricks, um, brick walls as soon as possible. But at the moment, uh, uh, wood is absolutely our best friend. We have plenty of wood, and uh, that's very inflammable, unfortunately. So we we need to use. Uh, uh, all our ingenuity to prevent uh, any fire to spread. Okay, in the meantime, Zebo is working on the heal root. The heal root, uh, guys, is very simple. Those are herbs that our doctors can use to, to cure, to heal our colonists. What is this? A steel uh, urine, okay. Wonderful. <laughs> Fantastic, really. Need defenses, need recreation, yeah, I know. So far you can have fun with this. <laughs> Here is full of panthers. And I need to be very careful because uh, if the other Panthers, let's say, create a man hunting pack, let's stop. Uh, this one will will die in eight hours, and I leave it. I, I leave her as it is. I don't care. Him is a, is a him. I don't care because I don't want the other Panthers to start uh, attacking us. We we need obviously walls to keep the Panthers outside. And maybe we can uh, then try to tame some turkey and have some turkeys. Blue, let me see if I can talk to you with one of my guys who's the best uh, in the social interactions. Probably Tinging, which is also very, very sad because I think she was bonded to the dog and she's in serious pain. Okay, we could sell some food, we could sell some pants. I, I really don't think I, I need this. I think I don't need this. Okay. What I need, uh, uh, though, is a butcher table so I can skin the panthers. And I'm going to do it right now. I will build our laboratory now. gift uranium he left some uranium here <laughs> okay quest available that's exactly what i was waiting for the timid baroness a new quest has become available it is called the timid baroness if you don't accept the quest within two days it will expire let's check it out proseria comnenos a Baroness of the Exodus Empire is calling from nearby. She's being followed by an angry cat. <laughs> She's followed by an angry cat. She says she only wanted to see the landscape on a quick walk and never expected such a deadly threat. <laughs> Proseria wants you to keep um, her safe at Colony for a few hours and this air shuttle can come pick her up. Yeah, sure. Accept the quest. Who? Ah, okay, I should accept with someone. Uh, let's use uh, who is our our best uh, bio. I think Ting Ting is the best in this case. Uh, except with Ting Ting. Good. Proseria joins. Let let me see. Here we go. Look at look at the hat. <laughs> she's she's just like a pope, like a, a she pope. <laughs> Wonderful. And here we have the angry cat. Oh man. They will go and fight before Prozea gets attacked by the angry cat. So funny. Look, look at this! This is, this is so ridiculous. Where are you, Zebo? This thing is so ridiculous. The Baroness. Oh no! The, the cat is killing her! No! I need to save her! I need to save the... I need to save her majesty! 
Sebo, kill the cat. Beryl, come with your, your uh, gun as well. We need the revolver. No, okay, we killed him. Her Majesty, don't die. Don't die. Oh, man. Oh, man. Now I hope that she will not get killed by a panther because she was scared about an angry cat. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Okay, I, I, I think we could build another copy of, of the bed. And actually some uh, also bed tables, so this will increase the sleep quality. And also the Baroness can sleep with us. Unless, ah, no, the shuttle has arrived already. Uh-huh. Auto load. Okay, it seems she's going directly to the shuttle. Yeah. I'm so sorry, I wish I could uh, I could uh, heal her, but... Send. Cool. <laughs> uh, that's fantastic. Freeholder title gained, ting ting. Yeoman title gained, ting ting. Quest completed, okay. Okay, Ting Ting received the title of Yeoman from the Exodus Empire. She's allowed to use these implants. Psychic Amplifier, one. She will receive the following items via transport port, Psychic Amplifier. If she dies, this title will be inherited by Barry Curtis, this guy here. Cool, and Ting Ting, uh, free older? Nothing, she got two ranks, basically. Yeah, here we go, Yeoman. Let me check. So, okay, the, the, the tier one, okay, the first level, one royal favor is freeholder. The second level is Yeoman, and uh, um, it gives us the possibility to use an implant, which is has just arrived, which is this one. Psychic amplifier. It costs $1,200. Wow. An architect device that links the brain to a larger psychic field. With training in specific abilities, the user can throw psychas with diverse effect. This implant can be upgraded through several levels. Higher levels permit the use of a more powerful psychas. Check it out. Of course, I install it. I don't care about any health problems. Let me see. Psychic amplifier, psychic entropy limit plus thirty percent, recovery rate for hundred percent, and now we have this thing here. Psychic Entropy increases after performing a side cast. Going over the safe limit can lead to learn term health consequences. Ooh, we need to be careful. What, where can I use it, to be honest? I have no idea. Here. Pain block, level 1. Block pain pathways in the target's brain for a short time. This can allow a person to move and act even with grievous injuries, which would normally incapacitate them for real. Let's try on this, on this panther. Wait, huh? Because I want to see if the panther gets incapacitated, if I can re revitalize it, you know. Let me see if it works. Come on, but guys, you know, you have to, you have to aim at the panther. Jesus. <laughs> oh, come on. I want to use this, this, um... Is that the panther is dead? There is nothing else to use. Okay, but as far as I understand, when someone is um, uh, on the ground, maybe bleeding to, de to death, or um, he is having a very bad uh, side effect of a drug, Ting Ting now can uh, just for a short time give him enough strength to go to and move to a bed, which is fantastic. Guys, this is fantastic. Let's be the butcher table. And uh, a simple research bench in our lab laboratory. And uh, two chairs. And now we speed a little bit up everything. The butcher table is not for the meat because, as you know, I won't be able to, to cook all this meat unless I don't... Uh, uh, maybe. I